Welcome to Adnan Thief Animations. Today will be exciting tutorial. That's the this tutorial is about that shape keys of eye lids and eyes blinking. So first uh, we need to check this out. Our character is rigid, very well or not. In this thing, I can see this is the character working is very good. If you like my videos, please subscribe with Narrative Animations. If you want to be complete rigging course about Blender or Maya, you can check the link in the description. Now, this is very important thing that you will need to be to when you want to go animation, you need to be a shape keys of some kind of characters really need that the shape keys so what is the uh, process of making shape keys or uh, repairing shape keys if existing shape keys are repairing no this character i have uh, this project is from the client you can see i I have checking this the eyelid some shape keys are broken the client asked me to fix these eyelids and make six more shape keys to add them so I am working on that this thing is so we need to be delete all shape keys existing shape keys and this one shape key has uh, i we need to uh, default pose of this eyelids are closed eyelids so we need to be delete all other shape keys and the default shape key that eyelids are closed we need to set as default <laughs> so this is the basic shape key and then i have added another shape keys in step by step so in this case we what we do the next the next thing is you need to be add another shape key to make damage first we need to save and then plus button that makes a, another shape key that's the, you can see this is the blink so when we set the value one that is make that is going to work zero is the default pose so what is the process of the sh making shape key of that so first we need to select vertices of eyelid and then need to be separate top eyelid and bottom because we need to add this add them separate by bottom and top so first we need to set the origin at the, add the 3d cursor and the, this is origin is now control that only eyelids so what we do that no go to the edit mode and then select bottom click l to select all click one vertices and select press l to select all then go to separate right click separate by selection and this eyelid bottom eyelid is separated from the top eyelid so we need to be select same thing again select one vertices and press l to keyboard and then you can see this is the separate uh, meshes are separated so we need to rename as bottom and the eyelid rename is to the top so it's need to be renaming because it's very helpful at the later 
bottom and top so what is the next process next process we need to be add the, make the shape key that will work as uh, in during animation so first we need to make a top blink that and the second shape key that mean bottom blink that means the top eyelid open that going to upwards and bottom eyelid going that downwards so that is the first step we are making that the eyelid from top first we need to save all process if you like all the animations then hit like button and subscribe the native animations that will very really appreciate it to making a tutorial so first we need to select edit mode and go to select the top eyelid first we need to change the value go to one and then select the eyelid and scale option that is now i am going to scale down and transform the object into hide into the head so where well, once we you can see this is when i going to value zero this is the default value and then go to one it's opening the open the eyelid topwards and then same thing we need to be make this happens on the bottom link so first first we need to select bottom and then go to edit mode uh, it's uh, something wrong bottom blink is it something wrong with the, this is the uh, we don't need to be same thing again so first uh, uh, this uh, shape different shape and go to shape and then go to edit mode and then oh, same thing then select vertices and press keyboard to add press a press l button to keyboard first uh, we need to be add the same thing is that the set origin to the 3d cursor and then go to edit mode and then select just simply transform to the down if i can if i can do a scaling option same as repeated but uh, it's work with also work with transform scale and rotation the shape is everywhere work so what first we need to add to be uh, select uh, this uh, object so select one vertices and press l key to keyboard that's select all and then scale down same as a previous as stop linking so then go to transform down and height in the and hidden to the mouth so it's uh, not working well so again we need to be a uh, uh, that's the other thing we can use also use that the sculpt tool and then go to the elect elastic deform brush that will be uh, work with this very efficient work that you uh, we can do the sculpting brush all shape keys are working very well now you can see this is hidden and now 
this is open from downwards now you can see the shape keys are very well so what is the process of fixing that the top eyelid that's it's are broken because the this the uh, the bottom mesh that's eyes are upwards and the uh, eyelids are with distracting the mesh interacting the mesh with so what is the what uh, thing to be fix this problem so this problem is uh, you can fix now this these problems are going to be sculpting to little bit transformation little bit adjustment that may help you to fix the problem so sculpting brush is going to be a fix that so you can add any sculpture that any fixes to set the value at any point and you can adjust your mesh so i am now going to adjust the point value that 0.224 and going to adjust the mesh if you like my videos non-thief animations you can subscribe and share the all every other so this is going to i'm going to sculpt mode and then you can check this is the first on the mirror thing and then go to the strength of a uh, little bit low because this is very very uh, don't need to be very outed so this is you can see i am going to little 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 and very small steps to get out from the bottom mesh you can see this is works very well but some in some cases it's not work i'm going to select another point and point value and then go to be sculpting step by step and then fix the mesh to set the set this problems no i am no this i think this is the fix when when we open and you can see this is something is fixed and some is not and you can step by step and perform this action to fix this so i'm going to fast forward the video and then you can see what is the process see well now set is the key top and bottom key now setting up very well i'm going to check mode and then check this out it's very well now working is good you can make the every shape keys for using these techniques to make all shape keys you want then we need to yeah you can see this open all top and bottom and use as key framing to make animation of any type of your character you can using eye blinking eye expressions everything you want i also we need to add more shape keys that which have to be showing the face expression of these characters so i this tutorial is now going to end up this this is only for beginners this is the expression shape keys but we i am going to uh, not tutorial is not going to very lengthy so i hope it's very helpful to you thanks for watching keep subscribing on the animations Thanks very much.